Oh, oh, what is this? <gasps> okay, BoxyCharm May 2020, it is here. We are unboxing it. Let us see what they have provided us this month. Backstory, I will say I've been a Boxy member for a, a hot minute, uh, probably like three years now. They were my very favorite thing to receive for like two years. I feel like they started to go downhill a little bit last year. They started picking back up and now it's kind of sporadic. I have some months where I love, some months where I'm like, meh. I will say they've been doing a lot of customization things lately or questionnaires or surveys about products we would like to receive. And it makes me feel like they're gonna kind of start going the FabFitFun route where they are incorporating things that are not just beauty related, which is personally not something I'm super excited about because the reason I signed up for it is because I want beauty products, but we will see. I know absolutely nothing about this box this month. I barely saw any of the spoilers and stuff on Instagram or anything. So I don't know what to expect. Let's take a look at it. Uh, I will say I am just the normal box subscriber. I have the Lux. So on Lux months, like next month we'll get a Lux box, but I'm not the plus member at the moment. So, or the premium, I think it is for this one. Boxy charm theme this month is Mother Nature. Really cute idea, actually. I like that a lot because it was Mother's Day. So I like the idea of incorporating springtime, Mother Nature, and also Mother's Day, which is the holiday we just celebrated. So, okay, lots of stuff, lots of things. Okay, first thing, this is AM Beauty Care Dead Sea Mineral Vitamin C Serum Makeup Remover Wipes. I cannot speak today, I apologize. But I've never heard of this brand, but they've never, I at least, not that I have ever seen or noticed from the other things and the other options and boxes that I just might not have received, done a full pack of makeup wipes before. That's really cool. I am all about subscription boxes doing new things and things that they don't really do. So even though it's not something that I'm used to getting, I'm really excited about this and I'm really excited to try it. Personally, I really love like the Dead Sea Minerals. Um, I like like the Tarte C collection. I'm a big fan of that. Like anything that's using natural organic resources. And it looks like that's kind of what this is. Yeah, they say these makeup remover wipes help prevent dark spots. They moisturize, they brighten skin. They remove all traces of makeup without causing irritation. And then they leave your skin hydrated and luminous. What more could you want? So I really like that. Wasn't expecting it, but I, uh, I that's a really cool one in my opinion. So cool, good start. The next thing we have, so this is from Glam Glow, which I believe I've received a couple things from Glam Glow from BoxyCharm. I've never purchased anything from them outside of BoxyCharm, but this is the Berry Glow Probiotic Recovery Mask. And it is intended to, I don't know. I was trying to see like just what it's supposed to do for your skin, but it's not really saying, it's telling me how to apply it. So I, we're just gonna call it a recovery mask. So I guess it's just supposed to like, if you're tired, if your skin's looking tired or dry or whatever, you just do this little mask, hopefully it'll help it. I like it. I, I am a little bit tired of getting masks. I've said this in some of my other unboxings uh, recently. I feel like I get masks in every single box, Ipsy, Boxy Charm, Ipsy, regular, whatever it may be. I feel like I just get a lot of masks. So I've kind of got like a superfluous amount of them, but I'm interested to try this one. Um, I wish it did have a little bit more of a, like a description of what it actually does for your skin. Maybe on the card, which I always check at the end, it'll say that, but yeah, don't hate it. So, all right, I'm excited about this one. I'm really, I'm really excited about this one actually. Um, so this is a Moda Pro by Royal and Lang Nickel five piece deluxe eye kit. They are brushes. This is a really nice little brush kit. I'm trying to decide if I want to open it or not. Cause a lot of times I leave my brushes sealed just in case I decide to give them away. I think I'm going to keep them, but I'm, I haven't fully committed to the idea of it yet just because I, I would like to do a little more research before, but it is a nice five piece kit. They seem really sturdy. Um, the texture, they seem like they're texturized and I personally am a big fan of texturized uh, handles on brushes because it gives me a little bit easier of a grip. I know that sounds silly, but I really like them. And it comes with a shading brush, a crease brush, a detail brush with a point, um, a smudge brush, and then a lining brush. So you get pretty much everything to do like a full eye look with that. That's a really nice little eye kit. I know I, I get brushes a lot too, but I think if the brushes are really good, I personally would prefer to receive eyeshadow brushes and stuff like that than face brushes. I really, I don't, I have very specific taste in face brushes. So getting those in boxes, a lot of times they wind up going to waste or going to giveaways. So I'm excited about this kit. I think I probably will wind up keeping it, but until I decide I'm not gonna open it up. Oh, oh, what is this? <gasps> okay, this I'm really excited about. Like I'm genuinely excited about this one. Okay, first of all, this is from Trezik. 
Trezik is another brand. I believe the first time I got their products was actually in Ipsy as like sample sizes, but their lip colors, their lip crayons are some of my favorite lipsticks ever. This is a concealer from them. And if you guys have watched any of my unboxings in the past, you know I really love it when makeup subscription boxes take the chance on foundations and concealers because I think it is incredibly hard to color match foundation and and concealers when everybody's skin tone is so varied. So I think even doing those little questionnaires and kind of giving them an idea of like what your skin tone is, it is still a big risk. Personally, that is what I'm looking for in a subscription box. I want somebody who is going to be like, I don't care, we're gonna take a risk, we're gonna see, hopefully you guys will like it, hopefully it's gonna get you guys um, some new products that you can try. I really don't like it when boxes send us, if you've seen some of my past rants, you, I, I don't like it when they send us black mascaras, black eyeliners. Uh, face serums, very, very easy, seemingly universal things for everybody every single month. I'm okay with it, one or two of them in a box here and then, but when you're getting them consistently month after month, I hate that. And this box, there's one more piece of it and I can tell you it is not one of those items. So this box, I think they've really done a good job of kind of being like, here's some stuff that you haven't gotten from us before, let's try it. So I'm really excited about this concealer. Like I said, I love Trezik. This is a great full-sized concealer. It looks like it'll it'll color match me. I'm gonna try it just a little bit. And yeah, just not, I mean, it's really hard to swatch a concealer because the whole idea is that it's supposed to like blend in with your skin, but it seems to be a good, it doesn't seem like there's a lot of variation between my skin tone and this. It's a nice creamy, creamy formula and it seems to blend into my pores really well. Uh, the, my, my fine lines on my hand have kind have disappeared where I put it on. So this is one I cannot wait to use. Um, like I said, loving Trezik the way that I have discovered that I do, I think this is going to be one of my uh, favorite things in this box. So that's that's a really big win for Boxy in my opinion. This is a great box. I, I really am a big fan of this one. All right, got one last thing. This is from Ace, every time I wanna say Ace Beauté, but I don't know if it's Ace Beauty with just like an E and the little apostrophe over it. The apostrophes throw me off. I don't, I don't, I'm not good at pronunciation in English. So other accents and everything else really just messes with me. So this is the Scarlet Dusk palette. And I'm thinking it's a face palette based on this. Oh, it is. <gasps> it's not, it is a really beautiful eyeshadow palette. Oh my gosh. Those are colors are right up my alley. I, I love it. I have gotten a palette from them in the past um, from BoxyCharm and I really liked it. This one is more along my color scheme. I think this is gonna be something, I'll use it all the time, but I think especially coming into fall, I know this is for springtime, but these just look like colors that I would go for in the fall with the oranges, the dark maroons and all that. Yeah, I'm in the eye. Oh, I love this box. All right, so this box is hands down one of my favorites I received from BoxyCharm this year. It's one of my favorite subscription boxes I've gotten all year, if I'm being 100% honest. I've been highly disappointed with Ipsy Plus lately. This was gonna be the best month and mine didn't even show up. Uh, like it got delivered to the wrong place. So uh, this, this is definitely the best subscription box that I have received in 2020, which is an absolutely amazing. I'm very excited about it. I wasn't expecting it. Honestly, I was kind of expecting it to be, a, a, if I'm being honest, a dud of a month, just because I hadn't really seen anything about it. And I was like, well, maybe they're just not like that big and promoting it because they know they're like t terrible products this month. That sounds so terrible and negative. I don't mean it to, to sound that way. I just was worried that it was not going to be a great box because I hadn't seen a lot about it but I am thrilled with this box. So let's do the price breakdown of it to see. Uh, they tell us that these boxes are valued at minimum $125. I normally kind of, I buy everything on sale most of the time. So a lot of times their prices are higher than what I would be willing to pay for it. But I also can uh, agree with when they value things. So let's look at that. Let's, let's, let's grow down that. So the Glam Glow Berry Glow Probiotic Recovery Face Mask is a $49 retail value. I would probably not pay that, but I most face masks are around that, so I, I can accept it. Um, the Ace Beauté, Beauty, whatever, uh, eyeshadow palette is a $35 value. Uh, the Trezik Cover and Conceal Crayon is a $24 value. The AYAM Beauty Care Dead Sea Mineral Makeup Removers are a $17 value. And the Moda five piece brush set is a $27.95 value. So that gives us a total of $152.95 
Personally, I think everything on the list is just a little bit more expensive than what I would be willing to pay for it. Like I said, I try and shop sales and everything like that. So I don't think I would, there's anything that they listed at that price that I would be willing to buy it for. That being said, I do agree that it, the value is at least $150 for the box. I think it is a great value box. Currently, BoxyCharm is a $25 a month subscription. I, we price locked and we bought the year when they upped the price from 20 to $25. So we got, I think a month free. We wound up paying like $19 a box, but I really, I mean, I think at $25, it's a great value. I think at $19, it's an excellent value. So I'm very excited about this box. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. In the comments, please let me know what you guys got too. If you liked your box, what other things were available that you guys received that you were excited about or disappointed with, whatever. I love to hear what you guys got and how you're planning on using them. If you did like the video, then perhaps go check out our Ipsies for the month. Uh, those should have posted a couple days ago. And, uh, and yeah, other than that, if you haven't joined the Dark Angel family, I would love for you to become part of our little community here on YouTube. We're always looking to grow and I love all of my subscribers so much. So if, uh, if that interests you, hit the subscribe button and the notification bell so you see every time we post beauty videos, review videos, whatever it may be. And other than that, I hope you guys have a wonderful day and stay girly with the dark twist.